internet friends good morning welcome or welcome back to sustainable sierra youtube if it's your first time visiting hello welcome my name is sierra and i'm an american living in england every week i'm making a video about my family's life here and whatever it is that we have to be doing on the weekly if it's your first time visiting or if you're one of my subscribers that missed my last video which by the way if you're not subscribed you know what to do hit the little bell icon down below and subscribe right now um you might be really confused about the title of this video versus my introduction um i talked about it a little bit more in my last video which i will put up in here as an expert family we have moved quite a few times but the Czech Republic is the first place that I lived abroad so it's a very special home for me if you're a fellow expat or digital nomad you understand you can have many homes at once it's a very strange situation but anyways um, in today's video I wanted to pop in and do a little introduction because I was originally planning to have the last video and this video be one giant video but Throughout the editing process, I realized that that video was already about 20 minutes long and I didn't want to make it like 35 or 40 minutes long. But anyways, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys Prague Castle, which is that beautiful castle that you see in all the postcards and the guidebooks. And also, I'm going to be showing you guys the little park in the Czech Senate, which is at the bottom of the hill after you visit or before you visit Prague Castle, whichever or you want to do it. Um, I recommend doing them both in the same day because they're right next to each other, but the park that I'm showing you guys in the second half is right at Malastrump. It's got a metro station, and if you want to go up to the Prague Castle and you don't want to climb the hill, you can take the tram from the metro station at Malastranska. It's either the 22 or the 23, I believe. I will fact check that and I'll put that down here. But yeah, I'm going to show you those two, these two places. They're really special to me because I used to go into the Czech Senate area just for walks once in a while to hang out with the peacocks. And um, I just loved going up to Prague Castle because the views you can get from Prague Castle, as you guys will see in the video, are incredible. But yeah, anyways, that's it. So I hope that you guys enjoy this little video I have for you. Like and subscribe. Tell me your favorite part. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching. Enjoy. Hey guys, it's Future Sierra. Um, I just realized that I said in the last video, or in this video, I was going to show you Prague Castle. But I never did. And so, um, I just want to just pop in right for a second to kind of show you guys that part since it's the next day. I'm filming the little introduction part from here because the tram stop is actually right over there. Um, the tram stop is called Pravsky Frod. And you can also walk up here as well, but if you don't want to walk up a big hill or if you have children with you, it's much better to take the tram. It'll cost you just a few pounds. Um, it's called Pravsky Frod. That's what it means in Czech. It just means Prague Castle. And you walk from the tram stop around this way past the really expensive little food stand if you don't speak Czech, and the castle is just right up there. The difference between these ones and the British ones is these ones actually will move and talk to you sometimes. I'm not gonna harass them, but you could. So now we are inside of Prague Castle, kind of. Also, we have an extra guest with us. If she wants to say hello and introduce herself, I'm not sure. I'm Tammy, yes. and we met teaching in the Czech Republic. So it's been, what, nine years since we've seen each other? Hi. Which is crazy. Hi, handsome. But as I was saying, we're now inside of Prague Castle. Prague Castle is actually huge. If you look from the bridges on the river, and you see that big complex with the church on the top, pretty much everything that you're seeing there is the Prague Castle. But the first part you're gonna see is the St. Vitus Cathedral, which as you can see is really, really, really tall. So you can only get a whole picture of it if you have a wide angle lens, which I do, which is exciting. But um, on the inside, you do have to pay to go into everything inside of Prague Castle except kind of the courtyard area, and you can kind of just walk around it. Um, you can get into the cathedral for free, but you can only go into the front little area to pray for a few minutes. You can't actually see all the way around. If you have time and there's something you're interested in, it's definitely worth the visit to all of Prague Castle. However, I've been before, and my husband's been before, and the little man is just not going to have the energy to go through all of Prague Castle today. So we're not going to do it, but we're going to show you the outside so you can see it looks like. That's uh, right. Yeah, that's the president's house right there. And because the flag is out, that means he's probably at home. What are you going to show me? What is it? A dragon. What do you? Where's the dragon? I don't see it. Where is it? Can you show me where it is? A fair. Oh yeah. Oh. Why do you think he's putting it in the dragon's mouth? The last time I was here, all of that gold was being restored. So it looks a lot different now. Hey, what are you looking at? 
What is in there? Dragon. Where's the dragon? Working. The dragon's working? Yeah. Wait, where is he working? What is he doing in there? Yeah, but hey. Inside of the cage? It looks pretty shady in there. Should we have a later look? Dragon. Hmm. Dragon. Dragon. I don't really see anything. Dragon. You're gonna wake it up. Hmm. Hey, 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 what you doing? I am trying to open the door. Why are you opening the door? Because I want to see inside. You want to see inside? You already did see inside. What? You already saw inside. No. Yeah, you did. No. What are you going to do? Put money in there. What does the money do? Let me find a candle. It makes a candle or does it light the candle? Light. All right, let's see what happens. <gasps> Maybe it lit up. Wow. <laughs> it lit up that one right there? Yes. Aw, and it's late for 15 minutes. I kind of like that though, because then you don't have to waste all the, like, um, yeah. Which one is going to light up? <gasps> oh, cool. Yep. That is pretty cool. You see a big one. Where's the big one? Right there. Where? Look. Oh wow, that's a koi. Oh, don't scare the fish. Where's the big baby fish? Yeah. I don't know which one's the big baby. Hey, peacock. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I don't think you can fly. Oh, she can't. She can jump out of it. She can't. It's thinking about it. Yep, Ooh. How many babies does she have? Three. Three babies. Oh, the babies came out. Oh, they did. Oh my gosh. They're babies. That one was a Hidden secret to so this garden is this fake rock wall. And I've heard people say that if you look really closely, you can see little faces in it. Little man's trying to find it. And let go! Woo! 